Hello everyone, welcome to the Walton Hall live tour. My name is James Jovicic. I'm an RA for Walton Hall, as well as for our neighborhood, Dr. Walton and Gregson. And this is my CRE. Hi everyone, uh, my name is Mackenzie Payton. As James said, I am the CRE, or Coordinator for Residence Education, um, for Walton Hall and other uh, parts of the neighborhood. Um, if you don't know CREs, we supervise RAs, we do programming, I'm a resource for your residents if they need help with pretty much anything. Um, so yeah, send them my way. All right, so uh, Walton Hall, we have around 158 people in this dorm hall. Um, and right here is our main community room, so it's called the Brown Room. We have a smart TV, um, some couches, and as well as we have kind of like this game room area right here. Uh, this is kind of where a lot of our events will be, either that or uh, near the front desk. Um, so these are two community bathrooms as well, um, in case you like have a guest over or anything like that. And then down here. So we're currently out kind of like at the south side of the dorm building. So this is um, generally where the women's rooms are. Um, and then back towards here, you'll find the front desk. Do we have any questions so far? We do not, not so far. People are just now joining. rooms we have another one just by the main desk and we just walked by one um, through that hallway and then here's the main entrance so um, and also this is the front desk so this desk will be staffed from 4 p.m. down to around 10 p.m. on weekdays and then on weekends it'll be around um, it should be 12 p.m. to midnight. And then you won't get packages here. We have a zone desk, so it'll actually be in the Gregson Hall, which is uphill that way. Um, and this is also where our series office is. <laughs> yeah. All right, so this way. Here's the kitchen. Um, so this is the community kitchen. You can feel free to put anything in the fridge and use all of these different things. Um, we ask that if you're using like the dorm um, pots and pans that you wash them out afterwards. We've definitely had some problems with that like this last year. Um, just making sure to keep them clean and everything like that. And then here is, um, this was previously known as the green room, um, but now we're just put in your student ID. Um, and then we also have study rooms. I don't know if these are, we currently are storing things, but um, we have two whiteboards in them each. And then this right back here. Here's like our biggest laundry room that we have. Um, it's kind of just like one of three. So if you're coming over, you would do some laundry here. You want to talk about the laundry app? Yeah, how can you use the laundry app? Yeah, um, so if you download Speed Queen, um, I just downloaded it recently, and it'll have, um, you should be able to put in your UART um, email, and then you can go ahead and change your password to whatever you want. Um, and then you, it'll already have University of Arkansas, so you'll just select 
Walton Hall from the list of options. And then you can like, um, you get two loads per week to do your laundry. Um, it's kind of, for the laundry specifically, from what I've heard, it's more like you get a total amount and it works out to about two per week is the main thing. So like if you need to do three yeah. per week. I think if you do any additional, it's a dollar fifty per. Center or anything like that, you're right next to it. Here also, um, when you're moving in, we'll definitely like be directing people, but you kind of want to, if you're moving in from this side, you kind of want to um, head in here and then you They just come with extra furniture for right now. Um, so this is easily like one of the bigger dorms on campus. You get a lot of storage. Um, and it should also have all these like cabinet measurements are on the housing website. So if you did want to ask about any of those. Yeah, now that we're in a room, we can start taking questions about measurements. Let's see, how good is the connection in this dorm? It's, Pretty it's, um, I've lived in Pomfret and Clark Hall, like across different dorms, and it's about the same. Especially if you're using, um, we have the, if you're using a Ethernet cable, especially for any of your stuff, um, that definitely gives a really good connection, but the Wi-Fi is good as well. We'll show, we'll talk about how they share a bathroom. Yeah, so these are connected. Um, that is like the other dorm room right there. Um, and you'll, you'll be able to lock it from here like someone can't get in through your room. Um, so if we want to look into the bathroom real fast. So, yeah, and then you get some more storage. Some more storage right here. Um, and each of them also come with two towel racks and everything. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. All right, I'm not seeing any measurements so far. You want to say some on the on the list that are. Uh, the rats are on and like the dining hall options that are very close to the Yeah. Um, the palm frets are close. Dining hall maybe? Here, yeah, like, hall. yeah, both of them, both of them are about the same distance, I'd say. Um, 1021 is kind of up the hill to kind of go the same way up towards Gregson. It's just right across from there. Um, and Pomfret is a little bit down the hill um, inside the Pomfret Dining, uh, Pomfret Hall, like dormitory hall. Um, but yeah, so these are extra long twin mattresses. Um, and our desk is... 60 by 24 by 32. Um, I think that measurement is a little bit inaccurate. Mm -hmm. uh, we just got we just got these desks in. Yeah. Um, so these are like we just got these these this year. Mm -hmm. So um, if you go on the housing website, it'll definitely have um, the measurements for these. Yes. Yeah, connection. Oh, all right. I think we can sign off. Okay. All right. All right. Thank you for joining us.